The final group of British soldiers to be sent home from Afghanistan as part of the government's reduction of the force there has arrived back at Catterick Garrison. 70 men from A Company of the 1st Battalion, the Mercian Regiment, returned to their families last night and Forces News' Julie Knox was there. After flight delays and rain-lashed roads, eventually the soldiers disembarked at Marne Barracks, where loved ones were waiting. A Company has spent its tour at forward operating base Shawkat in an enabling role alongside those mentoring the Afghan forces. They were told last month their job was done. The security state in their area of operations was good enough for them to come home early. At the time, I think everyone was disappointed. You know, it's been a long old training journey. We've taken over, a, you know, from January through to September, basically either training for or thinking about Afghanistan. So everyone, I think, to a man was disappointed, we told. But um, to be honest, as we got used to the idea and, and Christmas came looming, I think the guys were actually quite happy in the end. Ten men have been left behind in mission-specific roles. And now the long journey back is done, it's great to be home. A lot of waiting, to be honest. A lot of waiting. Uh, just happy to be back and uh, see those guys. One devoted granny drove for four hours to collect the rest of the family to surprise their soldier after his first operational tour. I was enrolled as a driver and then as well as foot patrols as well. But my main job was a driver. Uh, what were you driving? Uh, the Mastiffs. Good vehicle. Was his letter lovely to receive? Is he good at writing? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> actually, it's probably the first time I've ever had a letter from him, but it was, it was definitely... I actually thought mine had come back to me. <laughs> I really didn't expect a letter from him, so, yeah, it was amazing. The company found the Afghan army and police much more eager and capable of operating independently. One of the last operations we did involved over 190 um, Afghan policemen, all generated by the district chief of police, we ourselves in a, in, a, in a reserve role, which, to be honest, we weren't really needed for. I think the timing is, is, is probably as good as it could be. Uh, yeah, we've uh, probably having to rush and do a bit of Christmas shopping, but yeah, I think I think it's worked out very well for a company. There's relief that it was a quiet tour with only two members of the company wounded and none lost. They're not on leave straight away. There's still some admin to do, but for these one Mercian families, Christmas really has come early. Julie Knox, Forces News, Catrick.